in the past, I reviewed the Yanzi AK-84 and this time we're going to take a look at a new Yanzi's keyboard. The EF-98 is a gasket mounted 1800 layout keyboard and with that being said, let's move on to the review. When I was scrolling through my Instagram, I found Yanzi's post about their new keyboard. I said to myself, it looks really good and when I've got it, it still looks impressive. I love that addition as a badge which can be taken off. After that we can see additional sockets for a few extra switches which can be found in the box with of course needed keycap. Another awesome little touch which I really appreciate is the coiled cable to match your keyboard. The only thing which I wish it could be longer. Also maybe a solid black color and others not only transparent. I think that this will improve aesthetics too. Only the white case is solid color and others are transparent. However, this lets the RGB pop out even more. So at the end of the day, for some of the customers, it might be a good thing. The last two things in terms of the case and looks. On the back, we've got a brass, which is a nice touch. And well, once again, I will say that plastic or in general case could be better quality because it has that noise when you're touching it. Maybe in the future they could improve it or maybe it's just the case in my sample. I don't know. Right now, most of the manufacturers are starting to use really good preload switches. The Gathering G Pros. I've got my keyboard with that yellow variant and what I can tell is the fact that they are noticeably smoother than just regular gathering yellows which makes the stock experience so much better. Stabs are also really important in terms of a good usage experience and to be honest in hand they feel actually good. Keycaps are made out of the PBT and they are double shot so they are pretty solid and for the thickness, I would say that they are as thick as Akio keycaps, but I might be wrong because I can't actually measure it. And now something really interesting, this keyboard is gasket mounted, but in reality, it sadly has the worst gasket performance which I've tried so far. I feel like it's just for the marketing purposes, because it feels more likely a tray mounted keyboard. I hope that they can find a solution for that, because this could make it a brilliant keyboard. Overall, I see some things which can be improved, but I hope it's just the beginning of awesome future keyboards. Because come on, it really catches my eyes in terms of the look and usage experience can be just a little bit improved but it's already decent enough to recommend it. And now I leave you with a sound test of the Yanzi F98.